Hello everyone and welcome back to another Bachman repair video. I bought this model a few months ago knowing that it needed couplings. An initial inspection of the locomotive revealed that a hole had been cut in the rear frame to mount a new coupling without using the factory couplers. I'm presuming they're lost. There is also a piece of the water pump that was broken off not too long after arrival and I won't be remounting it. I ordered some parts from Bachman and unfortunately you can't just order the coupling mounting so you have to order the whole plate. And I ordered book boards as well in case I couldn't reuse the old ones. Let's start disassembling the engine. The first thing we have to do is unscrew the front truck from the frame. Next, we unscrew the plate from the steam chest. Before we can actually remove the front plate, we first have to take the handrails off of the locomotive, or at least just out of the smoke box. Then you really have to wiggle it out as it's not held in by anything else. Here we run into our first problem. The wires for the front truck run through this piece and we're going to open up the front truck to see if they can be easily disconnected. Unfortunately, unless you unsolder them, they cannot easily be detached. And there's another problem that we'll come back to later. So here's the new part from Bachman, and as you can see, it is actually a little different in more than a few ways. Number one, as you can see here, the mounting for the actual coupling is different, there's no hole for the wires, and there's no mounting point for the front truck. Since the part is actually incompatible with this model, and I'm not sure I want to modify mine to make it fit, I'm just going to reassemble the front truck and the locomotive. It did take me a few tries to reassemble that front truck. It is very finicky, and always remember that black goes on the left. With the front of the locomotive being a bit of a failure, let's turn our attention to the back. Now there's already been a hole cut so I'm just going to use that and a standard Bachman coupling is just a little bit too long in the rear so what we're going to do is cut off a bit of the end. Here is my completed cut coupling. I didn't cut very straight and I cut a little bit more off than I wanted, however it will work and since it's on the underside of the engine, nobody's ever going to see it. For those of you wondering, here's what it looks like up close with that hole that came in the locomotive. And before I completely close up the locomotive, I'm just going to make sure that the coupler's ride height is the same as standard Bachman cars. And it looks like it is. 